Hello everyone! This is just a video explaining the thing I showed at the end of my uh, protocol video with the little smash. If you don't remember, I'll show it now. So please like and subscribe, and if you don't want to watch the whole video, all the information will be in the description, but I do advise you to keep watching. Thanks. Bye. Hello everyone! Firstly, let me just apologise. I haven't actually uploaded any programming stuff on my programming channel. I've only uploaded art. And I've only got one more art thing I need to finish and upload. Then I'm going to take a break from art, do some practicing on anatomy. But the reason that this video is taking so long, even though I probably should have done it sooner, is because I wanted to get it perfect. I'm thinking of all different ways I can make it better, what's going on through my head, because some things have to change. So let me explain the original idea to you. So if you remember the Smash thing from My Hero Academia, my favourite anime battle, well you should all watch it, um, I was going to make a platformer for My Hero Academia because there's no good games of it that we can all access. There's one in Japan on 3DS which looks alright, but I think a platform would have been quite fun. I had all these brilliant ideas, I even wrote them down on a notepad. First that was going to start with Python, me doing like a text based version of the game, which I did do for Midoriya, which is what you're seeing in the background of what I made and you'll probably be seeing me making another character. But then, this idea would have to be scrapped, for a good reason. Let me just explain the new idea to you. First of all, it will still be a platformer. And the series won't be a tutorial, kind of. I mean, you can... It will be, because you can see how, to, how I'm doing it and do the same. But it'll be more like my video diary of what I'm doing to be a programmer in the future. And you'll be seeing me make my first proper game, which isn't Pong. And it will be... It's not exactly hero based, like My Hero Academia, but it will be superpower based. I've already got a bit of a story worked out, and the character for it is going to be a special design that a little project I'm doing, which will be great fun. And what's good about this idea is I can actually release it. No matter wondering why did I scrap My Hero Academia again? That sounds amazing. Well, the thing is, it could have been copyrighted, and that would have been really annoying. If I released it, they could have copyrighted. Have you seen all the Pokemon fan-made games? Those all get copyrighted and then they have to be taken down and no one can play it. And I didn't really want to do that because imagine me throwing all this effort in to make a good game in my head, which I couldn't just release. Or if I did release it, it'd be taken off me and who knows what else. But I probably will be making it off camera because it does sound fun to me and I do love the series. So that probably will be my own little project I'm doing. Uh, so yeah, like I mentioned, copyright possibilities and not being able to release it, why I scrapped it, but also because story-wise, I couldn't think of a good one, like, there's nothing I could really do that would make it a good story for the game that's already based off something, unless I copied off a volume, but I didn't really want to do that, I wanted it to be an original story, but for my own game, I can't actually think of a good story, because there's no limitations from characters I can't do this or that, something, etc, etc. So finally, for this little update video on this summer project, it will be more than summer still, I'm going to be doing monthly updates. It's kind of like vlogs, where I will talk about the game that I'm making with you guys, and probably the My Hero Academia game, because I thought you might want to be updated on that. The updates will also contain other things that are going on throughout the channel. That's going to be the diary part of the channel, like where I just do monthly updates, just telling you what's going on, what's happened throughout the month, and maybe giving a little recap and showing some bugs bloopers, when I say bugs I mean bugs of programming which I thought maybe were quite funny, any bloopers like that in recording, and that's it, and I'm hoping to show my face on them maybe, just because I think it might be nice if I could be more personal and show my face off. If you'd like that please comment down below if you want to see my face on videos. But yeah, do you like the idea of a new game that I can actually release to you all? I will be starting it extremely soon. The first thing you're going to see for it is just me making a standing character for it while I did to get the design for the main character sorted and also a standing design for the background. Basically, I'm making a lot of standing designs and I'm not going to give too, many, too much information on the game yet because I do want to keep it kind of surprised. Basically, you're going to be a guy with superpowers and it's going to be really cool what turns out the story. The story will be explained while I'm making it and I honestly think it could be a great game. Alright, that's all I have to tell you. Thank you everyone for joining me and sorry for the delay on this video and all of the kind of videos that weren't hard. Also, please make sure you check out my Instagram. I just forgot I redid it and it's going to be showing all behind the scenes of my video making, of art stuff and of programming. So if you want to see more personal stuff of me, 
Make sure you follow it. It will be in the description below. And thank you guys for joining me. Goodbye.